everyone, this is Sam from Wargame Online, just going to be doing another unboxing today. It's going to be a really quick one, and this is on the new Games Workshop Space Marines Primaris Reaver kit. So this is an easy to build box, and there's three of the new Marines inside here. And they're basically, from what I can see, the new version of Scouts. So if you've ever used Scouts in a normal Space Marine army, this is the Primaris version of them. They come with the heavy bolt pistol and a close combat weapon as their equipment. And they also have some shot grenades. Um, this box, I mean, just, just on the back, it shows you that there's the three Marines which are in there and the, um, the painted up versions of them. And they also go together as snap fits. So you don't actually need any glue to build these. Um, I will be using glue and I probably will be converting these and chopping them up in some way to fit my Black Dragon army, but you can just build them straight out of the box. As long as you've got clippers, you're, you're good to go. Now they do come with three slotter bases as well, and three 32mm slotter bases. And again, if you don't want to use those, you can just snip the slotter base bit off the bottom of the uh, Marine when he's built, and then you can stick them on a normal base. That's what I will be doing. Now the box also comes with a small transfer sheet which is usable on the intercessors as well as the reavers so you can keep these and you can spread them out across your army. They are generally for the ultramarines by the look of it there's lots of ultramarine symbols on them so I won't be using all of them however they're there if you want them. The sprues themselves they are like I said before they're snap fit marine kits but they're still highly detailed there's a lot of um, bits and pieces on these the the same sort of kits that we've seen with the dark imperium sets that have come out but these have these lovely new masks with these school faces on them and even if you don't like them you could use them as a chaplain helmet no problem at all the only bit i'm not too keen on is the the shin area which makes them look like they're wearing shoes and once i've seen a picture of that photoshopped in i could never unsee it so i'm going to have to green stuff that and um, we do have the head that looks like the guy from mad max uh, Joe, whatever his name is. Again, put that in the comments below because I always forget his name, but I'll be giving this guy some long hair, I think. A really nice set of miniatures there, even if they are easy to build. I think you can definitely do something with them. The kit also comes with full colour instructions, so it's easy enough to follow to build them. And it's well presented, like all of the instructions we see from Games Workshop now. It also has a nice colour guide showing you what paints they use to paint the model demonstrated here which is nice if you're not too sure on which colours to use and you've got your little advert at the bottom telling you what would be use, useful to buy in future. Now this does have the rules inside the box, I'm not going to go through those because I just wanted to show you what you actually get in there and a quick look at the model in case you haven't seen it on the sprue already. But um, the rules, they are pretty nice, they're, they're basically Primaris Marines with an extra attack and shock grenades which are quite good if you want to assault the enemy. Hopefully this video has been useful and given you a little bit more to look at and if it has, give us a like, comment below if you're going to be getting any of these and what chapter you're going to be using these for your army. I'm going to put a little custodian next to this so you can see the scale of him. But other than that, I'll see you on the next video. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.